the YXS Orca stall and we're meeting Atika Bulgas. Atika, what exactly is your designation at YXS Orca? I'm the EVP Global Communication. Okay, nice. Tell me, how has IBC 2023 been for YXS Orca? Very good, very busy show. Um, our Viaccess Orca team made a huge work and we met a lot of uh, partners, customers, prospects, so um, it was good. I must say that uh, I guess that people don't want to, to go to trade show during weekends, so I hope that uh, in the future years it well, will... Well, they've uh, declared next year's show is 13 to 16 September. I don't know whether that encompasses a weekend or not. Yeah, let's see if it can <laughs> be during day, weekdays, it will be great. Uh, okay. And uh, what are the main products that you're showcasing out here? So for this year at IBC, we are focusing on powering the human side of technology. So meaning that um, with our data-driven solutions, we want to empower our customers, streamline their operations so that they can provide the best viewer experience and the best engagement for their end users. So it's from... Um, Generative, generative AI innovations, the use of generative AI is powered by human to augment the capabilities and not to replace them. There is also all around monetization, of course, like targeted advertising, but through personalization and user-driven TV uh, so that the viewer keeps their engagement mm -hmm. um, because you know there is so many offering that you really need to be unique so we're helping our customer to to do the best and unique offering to their end users uh, we are also providing um, solutions tuned to the monitoring of the quality of service and the quality of experience our QX suite so that uh, we ease again the process for our customers and the operations so is there any brand new product that you've showcased here so as i mentioned so there is also one on the uh, anti-piracy uh, area which is around the cdn leaching and how to fight this new piracy threat mm -hmm. because it's a pain for the operators and for the uh, cdn providers as well and this new uh, innovation that we're showcasing um, jointly with microsoft azure OpenAI. It's how the generative AI and LLMs are impacting our industry through two pillars. One is through the content discovery and recommendation, how it can help uh, the operators to provide the best recommendation to their end users. And on the other hand, it's how with our security assets, we can, with AI, we can identify the authenticity of a content creation, a watermark it so that we prove mm -hmm. that the content is authentic. The, the authentic one.